The Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission now presents JETCO and you. In part one of this two-part feature, we shared highlights of the desktop computer handover ceremony for Geisel High School held at the office of the Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission JADCO in February. Geisel High School was awarded five desktop computers for outstanding participation in the 2022 Virtual Junior Athletes Anti-Doping Education Workshops, which ran from October 5 to 26 for four regions across the island. Geisel High School had the most participants online for Region 1, which comprises secondary schools in Kingston and St. Andrew, St. Thomas and St. Catherine. The remaining three schools which were awarded five desktop computers are Fogo Road High School, Petersfield High School and Oterius High School. In May, the Commission hosted handover ceremonies at each school, declaring them the winner for each region. It was Fogo Road High School's third consecutive year being awarded technological devices for their outstanding participation in the Junior Athletes Anti-Doping Education Workshop for Region 2, which includes schools from Clarendon, Manchester and St. Elizabeth. The institution was presented with five desktop computers on Tuesday, May 16, 2023. I'm elated this morning to see that five desktop computers which are well needed to my, for my students. We have out of the pandemic, so to speak, and, and students are back face to face. Students were also very appreciative of the commission's gesture. Well, I feel amazed and appreciative because it would really help because it's SBA season and it would really help me to do my SBAs. The winner for Region 3 was Petersfield High School. We are in need of these equipment. Our students' learning is paramount. Right now, we are at a point where we want to improve our students' learning, and ICT, as you know, is a way to go. So this contribution that you have given to us will go a far way in impacting our students positively. Also speaking at the event was George Wright, Member of Parliament, Westmoreland Central. Today, thanks to Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission and their partners, our student will have the opportunity to explore a world of knowledge and unleash their creativity like never before. Ocherius High School was declared the winner for Region 4 for the third consecutive year. As a result, on Monday, May 29, 2023, the institution was presented with five desktop computers for having the most participants online for the region, which includes schools from the parishes of St. Anne, St. Mary, Portland, and sections of Trelawney. We congratulate you and we say thanks wholeheartedly for what you have been doing, not only for Ocherius High School, but the students and the schools of Jamaica land we love. My advice to students about keeping sport clean is that it's not always about winning and when the focus becomes winning you will take any measure or you will go that extra mile to win and hence you will participate in these activities. So when you keep the focus on improving and um, gaining the experience through the sport then know you will eliminate all of those other kinds of activities. During the handover ceremony at Otterius High School, Executive Director of JADCO, June Spence Jarrett, reaffirmed that the continued support of all stakeholders was critical to the Commission's success. We cannot become the premier world-class anti-doping organization without you. The Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission committed to the fight against doping in sport. To learn more about the fight against doping in sport, contact JADCO at 876-929-3500 or visit its office at Balata Multiplex, 1 Balata Avenue, Kingston 10. You may also log on to its website, jadco.gov.jm. Feel free to check out the Commission's Facebook, Instagram and Twitter pages. JADCO and You was brought to you by the Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission.